Hi there, it's Jill here from the creative team. I've got to show you something really exciting today and it's something that's right up my street because it's all about fairies. So here we are. I have created this amazing fairy box and it's like a window scene. So when you open up the patio door here on both sides, you can see inside all the amazing creations that's there with all the fairies and the die cuts. So what we have is this one in the purple and the green is Razzie's Sticky Wings. Next to her in the pink at the front there she has splits and she splits pretty pose. Then the next one at the back there with the blue hair in the yellow she is Little Peanut Brittle Sticky Wings. And this beauty on the front here, she's called Layla Sweet Meadows Magic. And look at her with her magic wand and her whoosh. All the dyes that are used in this, so it's like the butterfly, the flower here, the little flourish at the side, all the ones that's in the inside here, they're all Spellbinders dyes. And this one at the front here, if I zoom in and you can get a wee close up, this is one of the ones that was on the front of the last Tattered Lace magazine. So it was an exclusive to Create and Craft magazine because not only did it have all the, the flourish work and the one little bird, but it also had extra three wee birdies. So these two and this little one here. That was the three dies that came with it as well. So this is what I've been making and I have made it using a very old 3D Builder CD from um, Crafter's Companion. Now I totally love the flower fairies and my favourite just has to be Candy Tuft. Here's the one that's pictured just at the top up here. So I adore this CD and it, it's perfect because it takes you through step by step on how you can create this amazing fairy window that I've done and a couple of other projects on there as well which I'll be doing in up and coming Lacey Sunshine videos. So in order then for to make this I'll take you through the tutorial. Now it's very hard and very long so what I've done instead of taking you through step by step of how to create the whole box because as you can see it's made out of a full, a full box I've done it all in um, screenshots so that you're not getting bored watching me cut all this out, stick it all together and of course have a swear box by my side because you never know, things always just don't go according to plan. So I've done it with the screenshots as it's a lot easier for me to show it to you that way. So I'll leave you for now and it's over to the tutorial. <laughs>